when I saw your study came out with the, the headline, it, you know, I saw the cannibalism. And I'm like, whoa, we're, were humans then eating Neanderthals as they were eating any other megafauna as they went across Europe? And then, but then I saw that you were thinking more it's Neanderthal. Then I was even more blown away because it's like at the same time humans show up, they're eating themselves. Like, very strange. Well, it does Go sound ahead. like the Neanderthal populations had, had, you know, it was not like super fast like this, right? There had been a decline in population in numbers of uh, or the size of the Neanderthal populations. Um, and um, we do have evidence uh, genetically of interbreeding. There is like one main event that took place before Homo sapiens migrated across Europe and Asia. And then there are some populations of early Homo sapiens that interbred again with Neanderthals, but not all of the groups did this. Apparently, we're, we're starting to identify different subpopulations, if you want, or d different groups of Homo sapiens that might have taken different routes, and, and some of them interbred with Neanderthals again, and others did not. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think this is very important to keep in mind when we are talking about this period of time that is clearly biologically and culturally a shift in Europe. It's that there's probably not one scenario. There's maybe groups that, you know, interbreed and maybe um, collaborate or cooperate to some extent probably some conflict that appeared in some area that even the world of Neanderthal is not one. It's much more complex and we are seeing that more and more there's a lot of variability of diversity culturally between Neanderthal groups. Some were eating other Neanderthals from their group or from another. Some were burying their dead. And so I think we have to keep that in mind. The world was very complex at that time already, and there's probably not one story to explain uh, this progressive disappearance because yeah, it definitely it's not at the scale of all life. It's uh, thousands of years. Mm. 